Anybody, please, Department? Hello, sir. Yes, how, how can are you today? You? How are you today? I'm okay. How can I help Who you? Who is this? This is dispatch, sir. Do you know that it's illegal to threaten someone over a federal wired line? I know it's illegal, sir. Why? So at the end of the day, we'll actually see who's the one that concurs in regards to what it is that they actually go forward with. I'm sorry, what are you talking about? Continue to get your welfare and your free checks from the Democratic Party. Sir, you sound you like you're an individual. You sound you like you're an individual that continues and likes for people to give. You're a receiver. You know what that means? Sir, do you need to make a report within the Uvalde County area? Yes, sir. What is your address and what's your address? That's why when you realize you're calling a law firm, and once you realize that, and you keep calling okay, here. Obviously, you don't need to make a report within the Uvalde County area, so I'm going to go and ask you one more time. Do you need to make a report? Yes, sir. Okay, what is your address? Right. I understand fully exactly what you're saying. So what is your address? Sir, I, I'm not concerned with whether you have the officers with you or whether the officers are coming here. Okay, sir, I've asked you multiple times since it's clear you don't not, not need to make a report with anybody county area. I'm going to go down and just plant the line, sir. I'm a giver. I fuck you. You don't fuck me. Do you get that? You have a police department. Hello, sir. Yes, sir. How are you today? I'm doing fine. How can I help you? I really don't have anything better to do. Okay. How can I help you, sir? I make money doing nothing. Okay. Now, what is your problem? I don't have a problem. So the slanderous, uh, lesbian and gay remarks that you've made toward me, all of those things, I have it here. I'm just going to let you continue to do what you do in this climate. You just would think that it would be a better world. Unfortunately, yeah, it's people yeah. like you who are in this world that make it what it is. Okay, sir. This is the first time I'm speaking to you, so I don't have no idea what you're talking about. Online, when I Googled you online, it says that you don't even have a job. Sir, you don't even know who I am. You've threatened my life uh, in regards to it that you is considered terrorism am, sir, and hate crimes. Service, I'm going to help you. Hello? Hello? Hello, I'm going to help you. What are you fucking Hello? deaf? Are you deaf or stupid? What do you think? Because you're blocking you your fucking to? number, they can't trace the call? You stupid twat? Who Hello? Are you to? Why don't you want to go suck some Hello? dick? How about that? You got the wrong number, mama. Are number you willing to have my foot up your ass if you call me again? I'm going to put dick down your throat if you call me again, bitch. Your name is Cunt. I don't even know That's who the what fuck your name you are. is. 2.30 yeah, in the fucking morning. Punk. I'm stuck to the dick. 2.30 in the fucking morning. What's wrong with you? Yeah. Come it's suck 2.30 in the goddamn dick, morning. You you're goddamn fucking cunt. Dirty whore. You're a fucking cunt and you're a fucking coward. Okay? Hmm? Why don't you put that whore on the phone again? You bust out my wife, you son of a bitch. You want to suck dick? What now, motherfucker? What now, motherfucker? You sound like a fucking moron. Now we got some bitch on here cursing us out. Have a nice day. Now I'm gonna fucking shoot your fucking brains out, you prick. Please, dispatcher Adams. Hello, sir. Yes. How are you today? How can I help you? Who is this? Dispatcher Adams. Do you know that it's illegal to threaten someone over a federal wired line? I'm sorry? Do you know that it's illegal to threaten someone over a federal wired line? Are you needed to uh, rep make a police report? Yes, sir. Okay. And uh, where did this happen at? All inbound calls in regards to this office are recorded from the day that you started doing this three days ago. And today we're going to put an end to it. So continue okay. to hold, please, sir, as we have them track your location. Okay. This is a university police department. Okay. You've called I the understand. Department. Right. I understand fully exactly what you're saying. Okay, so you are wanting to file a police report against who? Yes, sir. Okay, first of all, I'm not a sir. And okay. You need to talk to a supervisor? I'm sorry, sir. But you keep driving. Okay. Uh, I'm not, if you're not needing to file a police report, uh, then... Uh, I'm not sure what you're wanting me to do, sir. 
And also, I can tell you another thing I am. I'm an educated man. I don't have to use the words and languages that you, in the language that you have to use or the vernacular to describe what I'm feeling. And that's what you have to do. So at this point in time, there's ignorance on this phone, but it's not me. Okay, sir, I'm uh, not, if you don't need a immediate police assistance, don't need to file a police report, uh, then uh, I'm not going to continue this call. That's why when you realize you're calling a law firm, and once you realize that, and you keep calling here. Okay, sir, we're not calling you. This is a police department. I'm sitting here listening to you. Okay, well, you called us, sir. Two different things. You're playing games, and I'm serious. Okay, well, sir, like I said, if you do not need the police, uh, okay. you don't need a minute response. Okay. Sir, I, I'm not concerned with whether you have the officers with you or whether the officers are coming here. Okay, sir, like I said, if you don't need a police, you don't need to make a report, I'm not going to continue this call. Do you have anything else you need? Continue to get your welfare and your free checks from the Democratic Party. Okay, sir, I'm going to end this call. I'm a uh, giver. A I fuck you. You don't fuck me. Do you get that? Hello? 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 Yes, sir. Why don't you want to go suck some dick? How about that? Say it again? Why don't you want to go suck some dick? How about that? What are you talking about? Do you fucking realize it's 2 motherfucking 30 in the morning, you asshole? You're calling us. 2.30 in the fucking morning. What's wrong with you? What are you, th you're calling us. How about you put me on the fucking no call list? If you call my number again, I'm going to fucking report you. So report us, you motherfucker. You know what? You fucking you're a bitch. fucking cunt, okay? Yeah, and your mother is too. What are you, fucking deaf? Hello? This is Josh. Who is this? Your mama. I'll fucking beat you and your motherfucking kids if you ever call me back. Oh, really? Oh, thank you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take your dick, I'll cut it off and stick it in your goddamn old lady's ass and so it show. Oh shit, dang, that sounds good. Welcome City, please. Hello. Hello. Welcome City, please. I'm scared. Oklahoma City Police Department. Hello. 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 Yes. I'm on here. You called me. Tell me what you need. I'm scared. Of what? I don't know. Did something happen? Yes, sir. My name is Frank Garrett, and I live in Oklahoma. I'm scared. Where in Oklahoma do you live? I don't know. You don't know where you live? At my house. What's your address of your house? I don't know. Well, I can't help you if you don't tell me where you're at. Why not? Because I don't know where you're at. Why not? Okay, I'm going to hang up, sir, okay? You can dial 911 if you need help. I don't know what you're talking about. Welcome to City Police. <clears throat> it's a Frank Garrett. I'm scared. Oklahoma City Police Communications. It's a Frank Garrett. I'm scared. Why, well, what's going on? I'm scared. Of what? My name is Frank Garrett, and I live in Oklahoma. Okay, where at? I don't know. Okay, Hello. I got to know where to send somebody to. At my house. Well, you, you got to tell me an address. At my house. I don't know where your house is. Find a piece of mail and give me an address. I'm scared to death. Well, I need to know where to send somebody or I can't help you. I'm scared. Find an address. I don't know what, what you're talking about. If you want me to send you an officer, yes. I need to know where to yes. send them to. At my house. You got to tell me where your house is. I don't know. Then how, how am I supposed to know? Well, hell, you're just a baby. I'm 72. Okay, but I still need an address. At my house. 
sir, you got to give me an address. I don't know where your house is. I don't know. I'm scared. Find an, find some mail or something. Give me an address. I don't know what you're talking about. You have a good night, sir. I'm not. I'm done arguing. Retarded son of a bitch, you. Oklahoma City Police Communications. Hello. Frank, I gotta have an address if you want me to send you an officer. How do you know my name? Because I just talked to you. Nope. Yep. Nope. I need your address. You little silly son of a bitch. You're not a rocket scientist yourself. Okay, you're calling me for help and now you're insulting me? Yes. Well, you just have yourself a good night then. You don't tell me what to do. Hello. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. I'm sitting right here at all till uh, services, private services, and uh, that's what I'm looking at is you and your damn calling. My calling? You're the one that's calling me. Nope. And won't I'm tell me good. where you're at. I'm not trying to get over anybody. You call me. How can I call you? I don't know your number. Did you call me? No, I did not. You did. Sir, I'm not going to sit here and argue with you. If you want an officer to come out, you've yes. got to give me an address. Hey, listen, you stupid son of a bitch. Get off this recording and get a, rock, get a life, will you? If you want an officer, give me an address. Still well. Well, then you need to call Steelwell. Have a good night. Hello? Hello, is this Frank? Who the hell is this? This is the police department. You called our records and said that you were scared. How about you put me on the fucking no-call list? If you call my number again, I'm going to fucking report you. This is Oklahoma City Police Department, ma'am. We have call your number again, calling bitch, us. And I'm calling fucking 911 and I'll have them trace the fucking call. This is 911, ma'am. Call me again and I'm fucking calling the cops and I'll have them do you trace need the help? goddamn call. What are you fucking Do you need deaf? help? Are you deaf or stupid? Ma'am, you this phone number called our our line, so we called it back, okay? Do you fucking realize it's 2 motherfucking 30 in the morning, you asshole? It's not where I am. Where I am, it's 10 o'clock. It's 2.30 in the goddamn morning. This is a 911 line. That's why we called you back, okay? I don't know what the hell you're talking about, and it's 2.30 in the goddamn morning. Oh, I'm sorry for the inconvenience. My right. name is Frank Garrett, and I live in Oklahoma. Who's this? This is the Oklahoma City Police Department. Do you need... Yes. All right, Frank, what's your address? At my house. What's your address, Frank? Oldsville. I'm sorry? Horsville, Oklahoma. Spell the the place you're at. What fucking difference does it make to you? You're not coming down, are you? I thought you needed help, so we were going to send help to you. Yes, sir. I'm okay, can I have an address for you? You've got terminal cancer. Can you cure it? I cannot personally cure that. I'm not a doctor. we got that all figured out. Why don't you come kill me like you say you're going to? Sir, do you need help? Yes, sir. Okay, what's your address? Do you know your address? At my house. You're at your house? Yes. What street is your house on? Oldsville. Ersville? Duncan Construction. Okay, do you know your address? Yes. What is it? My number is 918-696-2788. That's your phone number. I need an address. Well, come down here now. they be a new sheriff up in the county union. Sir, this is the Oklahoma City Police Department. Hey, sure we don't work do for the sheriff. Speaker? Sir, I'm trying to get you help. I just need to know your address. Duncan Construction. Yeah, yeah, what's going on why tonight? don't you go find somebody else? You want to tell me what's going on tonight? Yes. I'm so what's scared. Going on? I'm scared. Who are you scared of? You. You're scared of me? Yes. But I don't know you. I'm all the way in Oklahoma City, and it doesn't sound like you're in Oklahoma City. Well, I don't give a shit. 
Chief okay, of do you, of do, you want, do you want me to send help to your address? Chief of Police of Oklahoma City. Do you want me to send help to your address? Yes. Then I need an address. Chief of Police of Oklahoma City. Sir, you're, you're not making much sense. If you want me to send help to you, I need an address. Why not? You say, why not? Yes. Because if I don't have your address, I don't know where to send help. Yeah, I'm 72. You're 72 years old? Yes. Okay, do you know your address? Nope. Okay, If you, if do you know a cross street? Yes. What street do you live on? Under construction. Under construction? Yes. The street is? Yes. Okay, do you know the name of the street? Yes. What is it? I'm sitting in Charlie's Chicken eating dinner. Charlie's Chicken? Yes. Okay, what county are you in? Duncan Construction. What county? Duncan Construction. Under construction? Yes. Okay. This is the police department. If, if you call us again, we're going to we're gonna need an address, okay? Well, I don't give a shit. Okay, if you need our help, then you need to give me an address. Hey, is your mama still got uh, worms crawling out her pussy? I'm on here. Who are you talking to? You. You're talking to me? Yes. And what was your question? I'm sorry. Pay attention, God damn it. Did you ask me to pay attention? Yes. Okay, well, I'm sorry. I thought you were talking to someone else, so. Hello? Hello? Is Frank there? Hello? This is Angela. Can you hear me? Yes, Angela. Is Frank there with you? Yes. Okay, he's telling us that he needs help. Does he need help? Yes. What's his address? I am at the Motel 6. Motel 6 on what street? I do not know. Do you know what county you're in? I have no clue. Okay. Can you... Is, is there anything else around Motel 6? My name is Angela, and I work the front desk. You work the front... But you don't know the address? I have no clue. Is there a paper that says the address? Let me tell you from the beginning. 30 minutes ago... The phone rang. Okay? Mm -hmm. I got the sheriff's department on the line, and I got a third party on the line. Do you know what I mean when I say a third party? I assume you're talking there's more than one person on the line that you're talking to. Yes. Okay. All I know is evidently they're trying to call 911 or something, and it's being routed to Winter Haven. Okay, are you in Winter Haven, or? I do not know. Okay, uh, so were you able to get, get a hold of the sheriff and tell him where to go? Hey, can you hear me? Hello? Uh, what would you say your name was again? My name is Joseph. I work for the Oklahoma City Police Department. What's your badge number? I don't have a badge number. I work at dispatch. All right, this is Deputy Brogdon with Catoosa County Sheriff's Office here in Georgia. Actually, I do have incoming calls from this phone number showing on this phone. I've heard your voice on a couple of different voicemails. Sounded just like you. I haven't left any voicemails. She's been getting a lot of calls from, like, this number and another number. Okay, so here's what happened on my end. So this phone number that I called had called our records department two times with a guy named Frank Garrett saying that he needed help. So I called the number back, and then I got a female saying that it's 2 in the morning and I shouldn't be calling her. And then a, a guy named Frank Garrett got on the line, said he needed help, tried to get more information from him, and I could not. And then the female came back on the line, and now I'm talking to you. So I don't know That's from that monkey. From that monkey. So to be negative blood is the highest blood there is, and you can't get no better than that. Who am I speaking with? Hello? Hello, can you hear me? I don't know if you are aware of them or not, but a few months ago, or last year, I almost had Frank Garrett arrested. 
they're using our number to call a lot of different places. Okay, who am I speaking with? This is Karen. Okay, this is the Oklahoma City Police Department. Are you in Oklahoma City? Oh, are you a real person? Yes, I am. This is the Oklahoma City Police Department. Are you in Oklahoma City? Yeah. Okay. You're in Oklahoma City? What's your address? Yeah. Frank Garrett is dead. He's not doing it. Okay. But they started calling us the last few days, and while ago, I told them, I said, by the way, we're changing our phone number, and I give them the FBI phone number in Oklahoma City. So now they're mad at me at the library, and they're calling all these different people using my number. I mean, is what the is, one that shows what is up your phone number? That I'm the one calling you, and I'm not. Okay, what is your phone number? I do not know. You don't know your phone number? Hello? Hello? What room are you in? This is the Oklahoma City Police Department. I'm in the dispatch center in Oklahoma City. Do you know that it's illegal to threaten someone over a federal wired line? Okay, who am I speaking with now? David Murdoch. How are you today? I'm good. So I'm I'm a little bit confused. I'm with the Oklahoma City Police Department, I'm and I've been talking to, be to multiple as, people. I'm just trying to be as of assistance to you. Okay, what's going on? What I'm doing is just building relevant conduct with you because you're calling a federal transistor line in regards to these matters at this point in time. You're in violation of commerce. You just threatened me. You have said several uh, vulgar in regards to my race. Um, that is a federal okay. crime punishable by up to 12 years in prison. So when you speak about someone going to jail, continue to call this line. And the only reason why I continue to hold is so that they can continue to track you through your spoofing where that you're utilizing. And okay, we'll track sir, down exactly sir, where is, you are through your IP address. This is the Oklahoma City Police Department. I have not made any threats to anyone. You're calling on a voice over IP line. This is the Oklahoma City Police Department. There have been no threats that I have made to you. And I have been mo talking to multiple people tonight, and I'm not really sure what's going on. I mean, the I'm, damn Faye Cooper and stuff just left listening to your tape and all this shit. I mean, we're going to try to nail your ass. And I hope you who I think you are so I can beat the goddamn hell out of you. Online, when I Googled you online, it says that you don't even have a job. Welcome City Police. Okay, this is a... Okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. I am not sure. He's been calling over here at the switchboard as well. Okay, well, we're advising you now that you have, well, whoever called from this number has called this district several times. Okay, sir, I've received the call from this number twice, and I've reported it to our dispatch, and they have been calling as well. Okay, I who's calling this called. number? Who's calling us here at this district? That's what we want to know. Uh, our dispatch is 231-2121. 252, what's the other? 231-2121. Okay, who is this I'm talking to right now? I'm a switchboard operator. You do realize that this is the police department that you're talking with? I'm Oklahoma City Police Department. This is the Cleveland Police Department, district number three, sir. I am a ma'am, and what? I am a switchboard operator for sir, the Oklahoma City Police Department. You, sir, right now, we, sir, you right now, we're, the only reason we're talking loud because you're having a feedback. Because as I talk right now, I can see the feedback bouncing back off of the phone. I can transfer you to our dispatch. Okay. But they're the ones that are calling. I've received calls saying someone was scared. Say again, sir? Again, I am not a sir. Okay. C-U-R-R-Y? Excuse me? C-U-R-R-Y? What is that? Yes, and it was, sir, we have it on tape that, that we have two calls from this okay, number. I am That's a man. Let back. me get you to our dispatch. Hold on. Okay. Okay. City Police Communications. Okay, this is a... Okay, this is Officer Ed Powell with the Cleveland Police Department. Uh, we're trying to see who's this individual that's calling the station here. Okay, I would have no clue. We have several phone calls from this number. Okay, that's why we were able to call okay, you right back. The, okay, this is the Oklahoma City Police. 
Let me get you over to the communications supervisor. Just a moment. Okay. And you're with Cleveland. What's your, what state are you in? This is the Cleveland Police Department, District Number Three. Okay, just a moment. Okay. Communications. This is Kaylin. Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. All right, this is Deputy Brogdon with Catoosa County Sheriff's Office here in Georgia. The number that I have called hey. is a number that has been calling one of our county commissioners. So we have a guy um, that is on the phone with one of our call takers right now, and I don't know what he's doing, but he keeps like transferring the phone over to you guys and then over to a Motel, Motel 6 clerk. So we're trying to find out where he is and what's going on. We just so had uh, several phone calls from that. this number, okay? And the individual, had, and we're leaving lewd and lascivious phone companies. He was saying how he wanted to have sex with the officers, and he also had other things what? that was threatening the officers. That's why we were able to contact this number and call this individual right back. Yeah, sir, I understand. It's not our call takers. This is the Oklahoma City Police Department. It's okay. a guy that's on the phone with us who is somehow transferring our call taker or getting you guys on the line. We don't know what's going on either. We're trying to figure it out right now. Okay. Got another call coming in. Yeah. See you later. Okay. Bye. Hello? You better not be my fucking cousin down south. You better not be no fucking, uh, you sound like my fucking cousin. You sound like, oh my God, what my cousin name? Mm, he probably down south too. Left me that good picture. You sound like my cousin. Somebody using my voice talking some bullshit. Good.